Yo, what's good, you guys? Your boy AJ from the DNA Show, DJ behind the camera. Got my boy Pretty Ricky in the building. What's you good? Know what I'm Fashion extraordinaire, right yes, here. Yes, sir. I got. You know how we, uh, we got our hands on these, this pair of uh, wonderful kicks right here. You know what I'm saying? Um, I don't know. I don't know how we want to start this review, but I'll just tell you now: <laughs> these aren't for me. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> This is the first pair that I've seen in person. So we wanted to make sure that we do a review for you guys. So you know what to what you're gonna get if you do plan on getting this pair of kicks. So this orange is with the sample tag, it shows inline orange pulse. So this is Nike's their own little orange colorway that they got going. Inline orange. So this is like a creamsicle on your foot, all orange, every hit on this shoe is orange besides the airbag so we got sample inside here so i don't know if this is going to be the exact color that comes out for you guys retail pair is going to be this inline orange but yeah we got the sample this is a nine for those who know nike samples come in a nine most times um and then they also have women sizing on here as well i know i saw it in here let me see if i can find it for you guys yeah so they also have 10 and a half in women's so I don't know if this is a push for Nike to make shoes more um, unisex, but yeah, overall, this shoe right here is just is just not for me. How you feeling about these, bro? I'm not rocking with it. No, <laughs> I can't deal with the shoe. Uh, <laughs> I got rid of my first pair. I don't like it. I don't think it's comfortable. This is probably something you might rock. I don't know if you wear it in this colorway specifically, but I know you would wear a shoe like this. So let's let's hear what you got to think about this kick. Right uh, here. What I take from it, I, I look at it as a designer shoe. I don't think it's really so much a basketball shoe. It doesn't seem functional enough to be a basketball shoe for me. Coming from somebody who used to hoop. Stop it. I just mm -hmm. feel like the sole is a little bit too stiff, and it's not a lot of flexibility in the in the sneaker. So fashionably, yes, it's very dope for me. It got the high, you know, the high standard like Jordan One look. And the, the silhouette is beautiful to me, but I can't do this colorway. This is a little bit too loud for me. Yeah. And I feel like I wouldn't be able to pull a lot of shit off with this. So what uh, we say a lot is the Yeezy Boost 700, 750, whatever the hell it's called. This would be the new Yeezy if Yeezy were to stay at Nike. Yeah, if, I feel like it's... that to be like the Yeezy 3 or something like that? I feel like it's a Yeezy silhouette. Like the, the structure of the shoe is very Yeezy-ish. But he just restructured it, took some of the padding out, took the strap off. But the silhouette of the shoe overall does look like a Yeezy. But like I said, it's a beautiful shoe for me as a fashion shoe, not basketball. Though. So what's the perfect fit if you had to wear that color right there? What's the perfect fit? Oh man, you'd have to go to the archives for that, bro. <laughs> <That's>, <laughs> this is for sure a summer, spring colorway. You can't wear this like on the winter, fall type of thing. This is very, very summerish. I would have to find something in my closet to go with these joints. It's not a bad overall shoe though, but it's cool. But just so for like. You like to rock denim, right? What's wh how you gonna stack the denim with these right here? What's the oh, best the way I would stack it? I would layer it over the shoe a little bit just okay. to cover up the top part of it, mm -hmm. and you know, give you a little toe box on there, a little hit of the toe box. I probably push the laces out a little bit, but you know how I do. I'm a little bit too here. Show him how you got his laces. You see, right I there. got my laces right here. You do. You know how I do. Oh, you're <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm out here. You know, what I'm <laughs> I do it a little bit different. You feel me? <laughs> okay, so. The next question is, what do you guys think about the shoe? How do you feel about it? The detailed shots and everything of it. I don't know. Drop a comment down below on how you guys feel about this sneaker right here. It is definitely not a cop for me. For resale purposes, yes, it's a cop. But besides from that, I would say no. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> God. <laughs> My bad. I didn't know you were filming a video. What's up? Curry hit a three. Damn the head. Pretty sweet. Okay. But wait a minute. The Nuggets. The Nuggets. <laughs> no, the Blazers are actually winning, but the Nuggets are going to win the game. Unfortunately. He's the uh, most pessimistic person <laughs> ever. He loves Man. the Blazers. He loves yeah, the Blazers. I'm like the biggest Blazer. <laughs> That's kind of backwards, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, it works. Trust me. I do it with the Steelers. The Steelers won the Super Bowl the year I did it. Hey, I see you. I don't have no faith in Portland just to put it out there. <laughs> I'm Jeez. just keeping it a buck. See, you know, I, I don't think they have enough thing. talent to win. That's just where he's I'm He's doing the same thing. <laughs> Deep down, he's like, Portland's gonna win the finals. <laughs> <laughs> Not at all. No, no, they, they're mediocre at best. <laughs> and mediocre doesn't win championships. <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna win. 
I mean, if they win this <laughs> oh, Okay. So, tell me what you guys think about this shoe right here. Uh, I'm very interested to see the comment sections. Don't go off of hype purposes. Truly give us a true answer on how you feel about this sneaker, the design, the colors. Tell us what you think and why. Not just say it's weak, don't say it's dope. Tell me why you think it's weak or tell me why you think it's dope. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Yeah, we out here in Long Beach, you know what I'm saying? We leave tomorrow. We're probably about to get it cracking tonight, you know what I'm saying? What's the plan for tonight, you know? Um, you know what it is. It's Cinco de, de Mayo, so. It is, it's Cinco you know. de Mayo. Nightingale. Nightingale? Nine All right, Nightingale it is. All right, y'all. <laughs> I bought a play. <laughs> I'm trying to get this shot. What is that? No way. <laughs> we can't get it to focus. <laughs> I'm about to start a YouTube channel, y'all. Make sure you subscribe to that. Y'all heard this live. You feel me? Mm. It's coming. <laughs> it's coming. Why you change your tone? <laughs> you were talking about uh, making a YouTube channel, though. So yeah, I'm thinking about it. Like you was? Popping. Yeah, for real. Oh, All to do it. Gotta get that style shit popping for these niggas, man. Yeah. Your style be weak, bro. That shit be watered down. Give us some examples of people that be having messed up. <laughs> I can't throw no names out there, bro. You trying to shame me right now. <laughs> what was your name? <laughs> Duncan Pender used the fifth. <laughs> oh, like, there's no point in making your kids juniors, bro. bro if they <laughs> let, <laughs> let your kids stand you alone got, as that. If you them, got a bro. dope legacy, then I think it's I, I agree, but most <laughs> don't have dope legacies. <laughs> Facts or not? Factual. Mainly you facts. Cold stone ice cream. <laughs> flipping, <laughs> flipping those sherberts. You don't need a fifth generation of your name, bro. Oh like you making rainbow sherberts for the, the troll kids in the neighborhood. There's no reason for you to have a fifth. You feel me? Like nah, that shit is stupid, bro. <laughs> bro, where does he come up with this? I don't know, but I love it. <laughs> that shit be bull. Shit. Let your <laughs> let your son stand alone and be him himself. He's still gonna be your son at the end of the day. So what he need to be true. a junior or a third for? It's no point. <laughs> no need. He looked like you. Good. Why he need to have your name? <laughs> it makes no you're sense. Not gonna, you, so you're not gonna have a third thing? Nah, hell no. Nah. <laughs> Definitely not. You're not gonna have a Pender Hughes. The nah, third? hell no. Nah. Ain't gonna be no Eugene <laughs> Bunder Schmidt over here, bro. <laughs> not. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all listen up. Listen up. <laughs> it's me with the boy. Yeah, I'm telling you factuals right now. <laughs> Man, I'm about to dip. Bro, you halfway there. <laughs> <laughs> you dig? <laughs> coming into town? I'm coming into town, y'all. Tell everybody to subscribe to the channel. Hey, subscribe to that DNA, man. Y'all get there. Be there or be square, <laughs> okay? Yeah. For real. I'm about to be on that joint anyway, so y'all gonna have to follow. Hey, <laughs> but, uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna need you to open the door because we got our hands full. <laughs> you feel me, kid? I'm struggling. <laughs> oh my. Come on. Oh, fuck that shit. How you feeling, brother? These refs fucking suck. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Oh, this is the wrong play. They don't show the right play. Jeez. Here you go. Here you go. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Foul. He just falls over. That's crazy. What's up, y'all, man? Hit the subscribe button. You already know what to do. You know what to do. Ooh, ooh, ooh.